Hello, in this video I want to show you how to generate new world in Valorant. And to do this, first let's open our search right here and enter percent app data percent. Then open a file folder. Inside you should find air shipper. Enter it, then go for the profiles, default. Here you can select uh, user data and de depending on uh, how you will launch your game you can go for single player which I would recommend or server and uh, yeah let's go just for uh, multi for single player and then select server config and inside there's a file call called settings.run now right click on it open it with a notepad and here uh, there's two different lines that we need to change and the first one is world seed so here I would suggest to go for three numbers world seed and you can use any combination of numbers like for example 589 then uh, map file it needs to be set to some save and I already prepared something like that and uh, you can copy it, I will try to include it in the description of the video. So copy and paste it in a map file, then click on the file and save. Now we can launch our game, so go for Airshipper Launcher, then launch the game. Go for the, sorry, let me change the language real quick. Go for single player. Here game might take, depending on what uh, hardware you have, it will take around 10 to 30 minutes to generate new world. So I'll be with you after that process. So right after your game loads in, we can either enter a world or spectate it. And let's just go and enter the world. In this case, I think I've just spawned in the ocean or a river or uh, this uh, file of water, whatever. <laughs> and the only thing we have to do is to actually make sure that this same world will load next time we boot up the game and to do this we can close the game enter the airshipper folder like in the beginning of this video go for your profiles select default and then enter maps now if you never created any other map there will be only one file so you can copy name of it and let's just rename it like that go back then enter the user data go for single player here server config and open settings again with a notepad now right here in the map file uh, you should set the this specific line so let's let me do, the, do this again uh, Valorant. and here's some load maps so we need to do it like that and after slash in the maps we need to enter the name of the map that we've just copied the name for so let's go back to our profile and maps rename it copy the name and enter it after slash and also add dot bin as it's very important otherwise it won't work properly now if you close and save this uh, settings file you can relaunch your game and then this map should be loaded. Now if you want to learn more about uh, creating world map for this game and want to do it with different options, let me know in the comments and I will then try to make a tutorial for it. And also if you like this video, smash a like and leave us subscriptions, it, uh, it helps us a lot. And thanks for watching, bye.